School's out, but learning never ends. Tish here. So you got a research paper to write. Where do you start? I'm going to give you four tips to get you started on the best research paper you've ever written before. Tip number one, you want to read all of the directions that your professor or your teacher gave you. Your second tip is to go into Google Drive and make a document titled Sources. Now, depending on what your teacher requires as far as your bibliography sources, APA for History, MLA for English, every time you go somewhere into a different website or video, copy and paste it right into your sources document. Now the third tip I have for you for writing the best research paper of your entire life is to open up another Google Doc. Now label this Google Doc research. I tell my students, if you're getting a brand new topic that you've never heard of before, for example, the Virginia plan in constitution class, it's really a good idea to find a reputable video that you can watch. And as you watch it, just take some bullet point notes. Now the reason you use bullets is because you don't want to copy and paste full sentences. Most teachers and professors have programs that they use for plagiarism. Type it out in your own words. You will never get dinged with plagiarism because you're using your own words and just some of the facts in your paper. Now it's your time to write a thesis statement. Even if your teacher doesn't require you to do a thesis statement, it's always 100% correct to write a thesis statement for a research paper, no matter what that research paper is about. Now, if you don't know how to write a thesis statement, I have a short little video below that will help you to write your thesis statement. It's basically a general statement telling what you're trying to prove by doing your research. So on this Google Doc, make sure it is titled thesis and research paper. So you know that your thesis is in there and this is where you'll be doing your writing. As you're doing your writing, just look at the directions once more and use those bullets from that other Google Doc and just start writing. Don't think about it too much. You're going to edit it and edit it and edit it. Read it, reread it. You know, so many students just turn in their work and they don't really edit their work over and over and over again. You should have read and reread your research paper so many times you're completely sick of it. And that is the key to knowing that you've done a good job with your editing. Now I encourage you to be strong, be tough, don't be lazy, organize your life so that you can do the best research project and you'll be a strong character person. You'll feel so good about yourself. Here's a little trick from me. Every time I would go to study for a really important test or do a really hard research project, I would always go get a little bag of candy. I loved M&Ms and so I would tell myself you can have one M&M if you do this section of your research paper or four problems for a math test. It works. Maybe your motivator is Fortnite or a different video game or something like that. Discipline yourself and say, Okay, after I'm done with this section, then I get to play 20 minutes of Fortnite, and even if you're on the leaderboard, you have to go back to your research paper. Have a goal to get it done about three or four days early so that you can really go over it. You can possibly turn it in ahead of time to check for any plagiarism dings that you have, which you shouldn't because you've been using your bullet points. And I know that you will be so proud of yourself. So work hard. You're never gonna regret working hard on a research paper. Now, 
I know that you would like to see my little Chachi Marie. So I'm gonna go home right now and see what she is up to. Have a blessed day and work hard. You can do it and I believe in you. God bless. Chachi Marie, where are you? Chachi, hi honey. What are you napping? What are you doing? What are you doing, love? You got your sweater on. What are you doing? Give me your kisses. Come here, come here, come here. Yes, yeah, sit. Show me sit. Good sit. You want a treat? Let's go get a treat.